What is up, Flock? Phoenix Ella here, and welcome back to another Farming Sim 19 Mod Spotlight. This is where we check out some cool mods. I give you guys my thoughts and opinions. I leave them linked down in the description down below so you can go download them yourself if you like what you see. Anyway, so we only have a couple mods to do today. So let's jump right in. First things first, I don't do many, um, how do I put it? Uh, non American mods. I just, I don't, but I saw this thing and it. It piqued my interest, so I figured I would go and download it, because look at this thing! Like, really? Alright, unfold truck, unfold it? Oh, okay. I thought this thing was supposed to, like... In the pictures, it looked like it... it in the middle, it was... It was, like, uh... Articulated, I guess. Um, oh, this looks like this is gonna be our place to add stuff. I've never actually uh, used the the shop thing to to modify. I've always used the workbenches, so I'm guessing it's in here. No. Is there this is, this is not an entrance? Where's the thing to edit it? Oh, right here. No, that's cash. Wait, what? Hello? There's definitely stuff on the ground there. Where is the thing to modify it? Uh, either I'm blind or... Wait. Wait a minute. Isn't it in here? If I have to drive that thing all the way over here, that's gonna suck. <laughs> maybe, maybe that that's another. Hold on, we'll, we'll, yeah, no. Okay, okay. Uh, can we? Maybe. Oh, that's even a tighter squeeze. All right, let's just let's just uh let's just buy. buy yep we'll just buy that <laughs> make it so much easier on ourselves oh goodness all right all right nope it weebles and wobbles but it doesn't fall down all right okay let's hop back in this bad boy I, I, I could have swore it said it it turned in the middle. That's why I was like, what? Okay. Customize. Ooh. Kind of like the color. What, what's that change? Wait, what? Configuration one, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. <laughs> One everything. Oh my God. Keep adding configuration. Does it change anything back here, or is it all in the front? I think it's all in the front. Let's do fifty-nine different configurations. Jesus, Pete. Wheel brand lizard, Nokian. Let's do Nokian. Top, front, standard. Ooh, one. Two. My God. Hold on, how many of these are there? Eleven, okay. Well, that's not bad. What are... Oh, the Michelin men. All right. Let's do that. Okay. Is it set up? Let's go. Let's go for the biggest. Yeah, 
730 horsepower decal one. Oh, okay. Oh, on the front there. Okay. <laughs> uh, let's, I guess go six. Oh, design color. Let's make that chrome. Yeah, that changes that. And probably the push bar and all that. Warning sign standard. Sweden, Norwegian. So yeah, let's do front and back. There we go. Customize. Yes. What in the absolute world? This thing's got three. So can I connect to the front? Hold on. Can I connect to the front of this planter? Oh my god, I can. What in the absolute <laughs> nonsense is this? Alright. You know what I want to do? Boom. And then let's get the... Ponzi Bear. This is the cutter I use in our logging live streams. Not a super huge fan of the humps. I don't even know right now. Lights. Do we have blinkers? We do. Actually, sounds pretty good. All right. Okay, it might just because it's loaded when, uh, okay, when it's loaded and you fold it up, you got no steering. Okay. Alright. Okay, I'm done. I'm done. I promise. I'm done. <laughs> uh, I, I surprisingly really like it. I know it's not America. It's not my usual type of mod I review, but... Uh, I'll give it a 5 out of 5. It's got a t crap ton of options. Way too many, if you ask me. Um, but, it, I mean, it looks good. It hauls. It's its something unique. I don't know if this is a real thing. If you guys know, if you're from overseas and you guys have these sort of things, please let me know. Because I, I would definitely love to see a real one in person. Because uh, this is definitely unique. About as unique as it gets, so 5 out of 5 on that one. Oh, I thought I sold all these. No, okay. Oh. Okay, looks like we're doing the track next. Um, 
Let's go ahead and buy this line here. Saving, please do not turn off your computer. Let's go! Pretty basic interior. Um, customize. Wheel setup standard, twin wheels. We're gonna go twin wheels because it looks so much more beefier. Holy crap. Steering mode. Alright. I just thought this would look freaking uh, awesome combination together. That's why I chose this one. Um, let's go over... It's under medium tractors. Sorry if you hear me like... Ooh, it's uh, I'm shaking my knee. It's a nervous habit. Uh, so it has 224 kilowatts slash 305 horsepower. Uh, it goes 26 miles per hour. There you go. So it will actually pull um, a cultivator a little bit bigger than this. I think. Um, let's go back into cultivators. So this one says 160. Uh, so you can pull. You can pull up the, 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 this one here. The Amazon's too much. Okay, I'll just go and see them. I think this one might be, uh, you might need a little bit more horsepower than what it calls for. Just saying. Compared to the other ones of the size. I could be wrong though, I don't know. Pulls it pretty good. It's actually a really cool looking combo. I like it. This is definitely... I'm going to have to see if I can find one of these tractors in my Let's Play series. Wink, wink. Because <laughs> this thing this thing's freaking nice. I actually like it a lot. Do we have lights? It has lights! Does it have blinkers? It has blinkers! Does it have backlights? It does have backlights. Nice! Nice. All right. So just for funsies, we did actually get a planter as well. And this thing will pull the biggest planter in game. Yeah, the biggest planter in game. 280 horsepower, so this thing has 305, so it will pull that no problem. What about cedars? I'm pretty sure the big cedar takes a lot more. 270, 105. There we go. Yeah, it needs 604. Okay, so we can go up to the second biggest one, it looks like. Yeah, it looks like the second biggest one. So not not horrible so for a medium-sized tractor I'm just saying it'll do most of your big big pulling all right so let's look at this bad boy test the three-point hitch uh, let's go ahead and make sure this planter is full huh Wait, what? Okay. There's only one fill thing, so I only have to do it once. Alright. Alright. What's... Ooh! It says it pulls it, um, but it... It definitely does not like it. We'll see how it goes. I mean, it pulls it. 
But it's not a fan. Not a fan at all of this thing. Alright. So the tractor, I'm going to give a 5 out of 5. It's a freaking awesome little medium sized tractor, I should say. It looks really, really good. All the lights work. Do we have a horn? We have a horn. So yeah, definitely a 5 out of 5 on that one. For sure. Alright. So I think all we got left is the camper and the house. Okay, so both these campers are not new. One of them's old, one of them's new. I'm not sure which one it is because I put both of them in my mods folder recently. So we're going to test it out. Oh, there, okay. Probably picked the bad truck for this. That unfolds. Okay. Let's go see the other one. I think I think this is a new one because I don't think the old one had the slide outs. Let's let's see. They do. Okay, so what's the difference here? Unless I have two of the same ones in my mod folder. Still can't get inside. Dang it. I'm not quite sure what the difference is here. They both have slide outs. I don't know. If you guys know the difference, or maybe I, like I said, maybe I have two of the same ones. Maybe I downloaded from two different websites and, and put both of them in. I don't know. Maybe that's the case. Let me know. I don't remember. I don't remember if the original version had the slide outs or not. Let me know in the comment section down below if I am. I mean, these campers, regardless, are five out of five. The only thing I would love to see is to make the aw awning unfoldable. I mean, there's not really an interior, so you know, being able to walk into it's not not necessary. But if if by some some chance uh, someone figures out a way to make the awning come out, that'd be freaking awesome. So. Five out of five, and let's move on to our last mod today, and that's this beautiful, beautiful, beautiful house. Um, now I'm recording this on Tuesday night. The modder, uh, I believe, is the modder of, and believe it's the same mod he's talking about. Um, said that there was gonna be a update, so this might be an outdated version. Just so you know, because I think he said he was gonna try to release it the night I'm recording this. But, you know, me, I'm impatient. All right, so let's go ahead and let's take a look around the outside. This thing is freaking beautiful. Holy crap. We got what, a fireplace pipe there. Oh, we got our grill. Hot diggity dang. Wrap around porch. Nice. Dude, look at this. Indi Hold up. Okay. Swipe our feet. Open it up. Uh, please tell me you can get in this. Okay. That's a bit weird. This house is protected by the good lord and a gun. Yee yee. Alright. We got boots. Those look a little bit weird. Uh, we have our rain boots. Rain coat. We got all kinds of look at these chairs. Yes, I don't mind if I do. Oh dang. Okay. It's very log cabin-y feeling in here. Birch trees. 
So it's saying premium coffee, the best quality. Okay, and this person likes their coffee. Wait, what? What am I picking up here? Oh, it must be the grill outside. Holy crap! That is a huge stove! Six burners? Holy crap! We got radio, microwave. Oh, somebody didn't do their dishes. We got refrigerator. Oh, this is a. Uh, this is an old uh, wood stove. Interesting. Okay. Another coffee sign there. Looking at a little island here. Cutting board. What? Oh, they even cooked me a pepperoni pea. I love this modder. Okay. This modder is new, my new best friend. They cooked me a whole pizza. They knew I was going to review it and, and cook me a whole pizza. <laughs> What's this? Uh, Frank Ferret. Hangman's Curse. We got down here monster okay oh there's a monopoly what little details like that i find awesome there's a monopoly box underneath the coffee table that's awesome we got some hunting magazines here a little laptop that tv's kind of high no, no lie that would hurt my neck this fireplace is huge too i feel like the fireplace might need to be a little bit smaller or we're gonna have to relocate the tv because Sitting like this, yikes, yikes! But I mean, at least you can see it from the second floor, right? All right, can we go up? This? We can't. <gasps> Dude, this is my new house. Whenever we do it, make a server, this is my new house. We got a nice desk. I would actually wish I had this desk in real life. I would. I would totally rock this. I need to know where I can get one of these. The drawers, all that. I knew I want one. Somebody find me a link for this desk. IRL. I want it. What's this? M M A seven co cooperative ag agriculture. What? Yeah. What's this? Oh, is this sell prices for like crops and stuff. That's cool. Got some paper. Oh, <gasps> a model tractor. The wheels are not the right color, but that's cool. We got a gun safe here. Dude, this freaking thing is awesome. The Holy Bible next to the bed. The freaking bed's huge. Got some more models up here. That's awesome. Wait, does this thing have lights? If we fast forward time a little bit, does this thing have lights? Like automatic? I don't see any light switches. I mean, there's a lot of light fixtures. I don't think it does at looking at these. That would be cool if there was a light switch and you all these lights come on at night. Yeah, buddy. The sleep trigger is even up here. That's freaking awesome. All right. Um, so not only, you know, we still have the outs. We still have the, let's go ahead and squeeze out here. Uh, it also comes with this, this garage here. Um, does this have a switch? No. Does this door work? Doesn't look like it. Oh yeah, it does. Ooh, a nice little bench, shop vac, hose, air compressor, workbench, leaf blower, propane tank, broom, weed eater. Got some crappy Ford signs in here. To see this has a light too. Is there a light? Oh, dang, Skippy. So wait. Is there a light switch in here? What's around back? We got water. That'd be cool if that was a water trigger. Alright. Let's go see if there's a light switch inside. Because having a light switch in here, I feel like there should definitely be one on here. We can actually fast forward now. We checked out the garage. Wait, 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 wait. wait. Nope, nope, no, no, no. Okay, yeah, turn the turn some lights on it. Turn them all on. Let's get back in here. Hold on. Squeeze. Huh. There we go. We can't fit through the door. Just okay. It turns some lights on. Which ones it turn on? Looks like these lights. Definitely these lights are on. 
Is there any other light switches, maybe? Oh, it turned these lamps on. Okay. All right. I see you. Definitely turn that lamp on, too. All right. That's cool. And this lamp here is on. That's cool. All right. So, yeah, definitely a 5 out of 5. This thing neat. The thing deserves like a 50 out of 5. It's beautiful. Look at the lights outside. I'll wrap all the way around. It comes with the garage, too. I can only... If this is... If he's improved it in any way, that's freaking amazing. Uh, definitely a 5 out... 500 out of 5. Or Yeah, 500 out of 5. Let's add, give them all the stars. All the stars. This thing's freaking beautiful. And that's going to do it for today's Mod Spotlight, guys. If you guys did like this video, be sure to click the like down below helps me out so very, very much and i appreciate it so very very much if you guys do want to see future farming some 19 mods spotlights be sure to click subscribe if you guys want to be notified whenever i do go live or upload a video be sure to click that notification bell if you've done it already do it again and as always guys thank you so very, very much for watching and i will see you guys next time bye